Adam, can I ask you an honest question? 50. Hmm? I'm just doing the days. Can I ask you a 50, question? 50, 52, 55. Do you still really want a newbie to win this game? Wait, what? Do you still really want a newbie to win this game? Yes. I mean, it's going to... It kind of like would, oh, I don't know, there's something about it that's like, got to prove that like, I don't know, yeah, the no. fans can beat the quote unquote all-stars. Yeah. I don't know how to say it. No, definitely. Especially since you know they all walked in here thinking that they could. That was the plan. Right. So you just take us all off. But like, I mean, thinking, like if, if it stays you and Porsche, I know. then we're only down to three. I know. And that's going to be even more hard. Well, that's the thing, though. There's a couple different scenarios. One, why is there a random mic sitting right on that thing? That's weird. Oh. <laughs> is that Luan's? It looks like it's a Luan. Or Cassie. It does. That's really weird. Is there usually a mic there? No. No. Stop that. That's really weird. It's latched on there. Might be for a reason. Well, I'm just they might have like that out here in case competitions, like somebody's mic goes wrong. And you can just swap it. That's so weird. Does it say the lawn? Yeah. Yeah, because at the in the bubbles call in the HOH the other day I had Cassie's mic on. Weird. Oh, in, in your, my pack. In your pack. I was like, what? I guess I like get those wet and then we'll give you your own mic back after. But here's the thing I'm thinking. I know that, like, a lot of people, like, talk a lot. And I know there's people that you probably have alliances with and, like, that you're tied to. But if, please, like, if you could keep what we talk about, like, please. Especially a week like this where I could be in danger. If you think about the newbies that, let's say it stays me and Porsche. If you think about the newbies that you would want to stay... You have a you have a better shot of me winning HOH next week than you do her. It's gonna be questions again, it's gonna be like period. And the only way that we could ever get them out is we have to start we have to win the HOHs. And you like nail vetoes, like clearly, you know what I mean? And so does he. So it's like trying to Trying to figure out who's the best four of us to that can do it. If it's switch swap, if it's flip flops, and he takes Porsche down and puts up Amy, which honestly is a very likely scenario. Again, it's the it's kind of like I don't know what people do, but I'm kind of assuming that they would probably vote her out, just because between the two of us, they probably would just you know what I mean? Like she's the bigger threat or whatever. Yeah, no, it's. I have no idea. No idea. It's going to be... I mean, I really have no idea what he's doing. Yeah. And honestly, he's very, I, I don't very... even know if he does. I think he's still weighing the options. Yeah. He's very tight-lipped on, on everything. I mean, obviously, I'm just going to talk to him and see... Because I, I don't know. I, I can't... You never know. Like, I have no idea if I'm, if I'm his target or not. I have no idea. I, mean, I think the, I've done enough to try and uh, just show him that he's never been my target, even if I put him up, but that doesn't mean anything right. when you get down to the wire like this, you know what I mean? But you got to know that they still, they still look at it as a us and them. There's you and Shelly are by, by far next, you know what I'm no, saying? Exactly. Like, and that's and, the thing that sucks. And it comes Ooh. down to, you know, if you don't, if you hmm? don't win, you're, mm -hmm. then you're, you're in trouble. An easier target, but if you do win, it makes you a target. Exactly. So it's like, Trust me, I'm I'm definitely I've definitely learned that in the last yeah. three weeks. So, but the thing is, he he can't compete this week, so he really needs for at the very least Rachel to win H O H. But it's questions. And I can shine through. And that's the thing too. Like yeah, you know, yeah, I won the veto, and I yeah. have competed yeah. well, but. 
my thinking would be, you know, if I'm in the jury, exactly. it was one stop yeah. versus who's coasted. Yeah. So yeah. that's why, like, you know, competing well is one thing, but actually winning stuff. I swear to you, when, when, um, when Brendan left, when he made his speech and he said you were all on the coattails, right. he, I promise you, he looked at Jordan when he said, or coach to the end. Right. And I was just like, whoa. Like, whoa. But that's why, like, you know, I, because I, really I, can see, I can see why people were furious when Jordan won her season because she literally did nothing until the end. And I'm like, she's so sweet. You love her. You can't help but love her. It's nothing to do with that. But then you get here and you're like, you've literally done nothing. <laughs> and that's why... Even know, Rachel was, H was thrown to her. I was fighting today to win, but... I was really hoping you were Porsche one just to be able of to course. take yourself off. Of course. That was like the ideal, yeah. the desire, the hope, the want. Everybody's all spread out. Everyone's like relaxing maxi. I know it's nice, isn't it? I know.